Hi Geometry, this video covers the area of a trapezoid. Okay, first off, we need to remember that a quadrilateral, a trapezoid is a quadrilateral with one pair of parallel sides. The parallel sides are the bases. We call them base one and base two. So in our example over here, this side is parallel to this side. We use arrows to mark sides that are parallel to each other. But this is base one, and this is base 2. We also need to put in a height in our trapezoid and the height must be perpendicular to the bases. So here's some places that we can put in heights. We can put in a height right here. That's a height and it's perpendicular to the bases. We can put in a height right here. You can put in a height anywhere as long as it's perpendicular to the bases. Okay, sometimes you'll even see a height outside of the trapezoid, okay? But a base, the height has to be perpendicular to the bases. Okay, now for the formula for the area of a trapezoid. It looks like this. It is equal to 0 0.5, half, inside parentheses, base 1, plus base 2, times the height. This is the easiest way to do it. Use 0.5 instead of 1 half. Use parentheses, base 1 plus base 2 times the height. So let's look at this example here. Let's say that this base is 10, and this base is uh, 8, and we'll say our height is equal to 6. So we just plug in. So our area is equal to 0.5. It will always be 0.5 here. Inside parentheses, we put the two bases. So we put in 8 and 10, 8 plus 10, and out here is always the height. So we always put in the height right here, times 6. And then we just enter this into our calculator. Okay? All in one shot. 0 0.5 parentheses 8 plus 10 parentheses times 6. This is what it looks like right here. Punch it all in in one shot. And this is our answer. So it is equal to 54, and area is always units squared. All right, there you have it, area of a trapezoid.